We are all set for football here in Memphis on a sunny 80 degree afternoon. The Gamblers and the Showboats. Todd Haley's team has won three consecutive games. You look across the way at Houston, they have four wins in a row. Here we go, Memorial Day weekend, little football. Derek Dillon goes high to get it on his six yard line and makes it out to the 30, and that is where his offense will begin. And the team was 0-2, threw for over 300 yards against this Houston defense in that Week 3 loss. He has been ascending ever since, Cole, when it comes to wins, passing yards, touchdowns, tops in the league. Rushing last week, which for this team, second to last in rushing, is awfully good. Right to the air, deep shot down the left side, underthrown and picked off by the Gamblers. Running inside his showboat's territory is Manny Bunch. Take a shot, kind of want to establish their aggressive mentality early. I think Cole just has a guy a little bit at his feet, and he just leaves it short. Right? What a great play by Bunch here. And so many times you see that 50-50 ball down the sideline. and Oh, got him on the hard count. Free play. Free play. Escapes the pressure. Room to go. A little flip up to Thompson inside the 10. And bowls his way down to the seven-yard line. On the, the left hash, 23-yard attempts. And no issues at all. Houston wanted the six the points, but after the Manny Bunch interception. Delivers strikes. We'll see if he can get one here. Six foot seven on third and seven. Four-man rush steps up. There's one of those crossers. First down Memphis. Tight end Daniel Helm. It works. 13 years in the league later. Reverse now. Derek Dillon in space across the 20. And out to the 14-yard line. They hear from the five. One reason they're rushing the ball well, that offensive line together for a second week in a row. That's rare for them. There he is. Wide open touchdown. Cole Kelly finds Vinny Papali for six. Throwing a touchdown pass here. That's big time for the Memphis Showboats. Done a nice job of stepping up on his completions there. You see him find the space in the Number pocket 65. there. And has them on a win streak here as well. Little play action. Buried at the 12-yard line. Loss of seven. Very active and disruptive up front. Quickly out of his hands, Vinny Papali, 45-40. Look at that effort. Cole Kelly's pass. Down to the 35-yard line in a first down showboats gain of 11. 41-yard field goal. Snap and hold are good. Boy, that would have been good from 50-plus. Man coverage. Hoping for the catch and run first down. Good tackling there at the 31 yard line. A little man the coverage. Right. Kelly the route. across the middle. There he is. Caught at the 46 yard oh, line. Kelly, Looks like he's going to have about a half yard oh, enough. Yeah. Yes, he does for a first down. The pass on fourth and two. Play action to White. Little touch pass. What a call. Helm, the tight end inside the 20. On fourth and two, the call, then the execution. 13 field goals. Snap hold, and the field goal is good. He's Shamari Jones is the tailback. Ball batted in the air. Intercepted. Oh, wow. Intercepted and returned down to the 43-yard line. Greg Reeves. Greg Reeves kind of gets... Walled on, he's trying to get the O-line, tries to cut him. Ball bounces up in the air, and he's just in the right place at the right time. They're moving a bunch up front. They're versatile. They're just winning their matchups. And there's a little intermediate shot by Bahar. Haven't seen much of that, and it's complete. As Mark Thompson next to him. Looking to throw to the left side. Another completion. Big one down to the 26. And here we go. Snap, hold, and that time it is just routine. No issue at all. Ball yet. Bahar, second pass in a row, second completion in a row. Good job of keeping his feet by Kiki Chisholm. Now we see Thompson. Good. good cut back in a nice hole. And the signature strong finish out near the 30-yard line. That's really nice play by John Atkins. Nick Vogel from 23 and 29 is good. 52, and it's blocked. Blocked right off of his foot at the line of scrimmage. Get your pads down and run ISO for a first down. 
Under center, eye formation, more again. to the ground game. Gap off the left side, another first down for Memphis. Big hit in the backfield. Right, with the fullback. Let's do it again. They found something. And they find it again across the 25-yard line. That's White. That was actually from 36 yards out. Down to nine. Now inside of five minutes and trailing by 10 in the third quarter. Steps up. Good touch. Great pass. A little bit too much for Justin Hall. Off the fingertips to brace the quarterback. You also have to realize where you are. And that you're up by 10. Kelly steps up. Floats one deep. Put it on the money, but the ball goes to the ground at the midfield stripe. And they have been the story shutting down Mark Thompson for only 22 total yards. Bahar pursued by that line and ripped down. It's the guy again. Number 99, John Atkins. And the Gamblers right now only have six points. Third and 31, little inside handoff. Plenty of space across the 40, 45. And out to the 48-yard line. Good call there. Kareth White, the tail back to his right. First down, right tight to end, the air. Triple pump, I think he heard you. Out to the 30-yard line. He's, he's soft zone, let me, hey, turn around. Give me the ball, give me the ball. Three catches, 42 yards, and they go right back to the ground game. Space off the left side, another first down. Just inside the 50-yard line. Kareth White. The poly to his right, but they go right back to the ground game, wrapped up in the backfield, and this will be for a loss. And a big stop by the Houston defense. Been away here. And even in the USFL, when you can go for one, two, or three after a, a touchdown, this is still a two-possession game. They go underneath again. Good job of making it out there to the 31-yard line. That'll be just enough for a first down. Bases second down 10. Empty backfield for Kenji Bahar, who's heating up. Pump oh, he's fake. got him. Open man, Peterson. 15, 10, 5 and shoved out of bounds. Great fake there by Kenji Bahar, who makes it to the end zone. Here in the fourth quarter. Wonderful job on the sell by Bahar, and then the touch to Peterson. Now they will take a closer look to see if he made it in. Thompson at 6'2", 235, a tailback, give it to him. Powers his way into the end zone. Now, he made it across the stripe here. We're going to feel still waiting a for a call. There That's we go. Here's his first one of the day, and called it almost didn't happen. The ball nearly comes loose as he crosses the stripe, or before he crossed the stripe. He did secure the ball, did get in, and... Kareth White, the tail back behind him. I'd run the sneak. Toss, sweep, in trouble, down he goes! In the backfield is JT Tyler. Right as White got the toss sweep. Four-man rush. Good pocket over the middle. Batted down at the 30-yard line. Getting his left hand in there. Knocked down to two. Eight-man box. Nickel pressure. Trouble. Oh, no. Ball came out. Kelly fumbled, and Houston has it. On the 19-yard line. Cole Kelly was set. Tim Bonner comes up with the fumble. Got to have a little awareness. We can't hold on to the ball here. Worst thing that could happen is a sack. Sack fumble. He doesn't see the rusher coming off the edge. Oh, they go with the draw. Thompson, 15-10. Inside the five. Touchdown, Houston. What a call. And what a run! And holy cow, we have a game. A good sell there by Bahar. Little bit of backup. Linebackers freeze, and Mark Thompson takes care of the rest. Bulldozing his way in. The Colt, they have been waiting to spring him free all afternoon, and what a time to do so. Three consecutive wins coming in here. Fourth would mean a whole lot. Blitz is picked up. Off his back foot, far sideline, good strike. And Memphis now inside of Houston territory. Still going, oh he's down, down. He'll score! Memphis rips the lead back. My man, Derek Dillon, what a play, Derek Dillon. You can't coach speed in a big-time situation. 
A good job by Cole Kelly off his back foot, waiting for that to open up, and then it is all Derek Dillon. A cut, a broken tackle, and he sees the end zone from there. Wow. Kenji Bahar, back foot, complete with a strike to the 39-yard line. The 29-yard line to keep this drive rolling. Bahar lets it go, near sideline. At the 10, intercepted. Wanted Isaiah Zuber, but found T.J. Green. The game-saving play. I mean, again, this is T.J. Green. He's on an island out here, single high safety. He knows where the sticks are. And that is just perfect coverage. Gets his eyes around in perfect position. And the Memphis Showboats had a four-game win streak.